A parrot's work is never done. As your field grows, so will our game. As in the parrot tales of old, you will always find a ship at the center of the story. One so terrifying that most will flee on sight. That is what we want for our parrots. Your ship is your entire world. It is where your success will be decided and how you will be recognized. In Skull and Bones, to build a unique ship that inspires fear onto your enemies, there are three steps. Step one, pick your weapons and ammo. This will make or break your battles. From piercing ammo that ignores armor and causes flooding, to tearing ammo that rips your enemy sails apart, slowing them down for an easy kill, my favorite is crushing as it deals a devastating blow to most armor. Step two, choose your armor. With our game's weapon counter system, there will be an armor that can counter each damage type. That's how we keep tension high at sea. Lastly, it's the look of your ship. Put on your scariest war paint and head out with a ship that is instantly recognizable. Making this quick adjustment will transform you from sneaky smuggler to hard eating hunters or swift traders. Now, when you are out in the open sea, it's always best to have a friend or two to watch your back. In our PvVP world, you can choose to switch off PvP to prevent any friendly fire as well. Lastly, our game will be crossplay at lunch, so you can parrot with your friends no matter what platform they are on. Ultin Zen, bon voyage, and see you all soon on the seas of Skull and Bones. This could be the greatest heist ever. And you, Cully, will play the villain. Fire! Ready your ship. Gird your loins. And seize that fucking convoy! Destiny is calling. And our names are on her lips.